Good morning. Welcome to morning prayer this Tuesday morning. I can look outside and I can see sunshine and I'm happy about that. It's going to be a beautiful day. And uh, we'll just begin our morning prayer in just a few minutes or a minute or so. Uh, so this is kind of a center ourselves get ready to enter into prayer. So let us begin. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth will proclaim your praise. The Lord is risen. Alleluia. The splendor of Christ, risen from the dead, has shone on the people redeemed by his blood. Alleluia. Psalm 63. Whoever has left the darkness of sin yearns for God. O oh God, you are my God. For you I long. For you my soul is thirsting. My body pines for you like a dry, weary land without water. So I gaze on you in the sanctuary to see your strength and your glory. For your love is better than life. My lips will speak your praise, so I will bless you all my life. In your name I will lift up my hands. My soul shall be filled as with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed I remember you. On you I muse through the night, for you have been my help. In the shadow of your wings I rejoice. My soul clings to you. Your right hand holds me fast. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Father, creator of unfailing light, give that same light to those who call to you. May our lips praise you, our lives proclaim your goodness, our work give you honor, and our voices celebrate you forever. The splendor of Christ risen from the dead has shone on the people redeemed by his blood. Alleluia. Our Redeemer has risen from the tomb. Let us sing a hymn of praise to the Lord our God. Alleluia. The Canticle. All you servants of the Lord, sing praise to him. Bless the Lord, all you works of the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All you waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All you hosts, of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars of heaven, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, bless the Lord. Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, bless the Lord. Nights and days, bless the Lord. Light and darkness, bless the Lord. Lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let the earth bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Mountains and hills, bless the Lord. Everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. You springs, bless the Lord. 
Seas and rivers, bless the Lord. You dolphins and all water creatures, bless the Lord. All you birds of the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts, wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Priests of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men of humble heart, bless the Lord. Hanariah, Isaiah, and Michelle, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Let us bless the Lord and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Let us praise and exalt him above all forever. Blessed are you, Lord, in the firmament of heaven, praiseworthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. Our Redeemer has risen from the tomb. Let us sing a hymn of praise to the Lord our God. Alleluia. Alleluia. The Lord is risen as he promised. Alleluia. Psalm 149, the joy of God's holy people. Let the sons of the church, the children of the new people, rejoice in Christ their King. Sing a new song to the Lord, his praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its marker, maker. Let Zion's son exalt in their King. Let them praise his name with dancing and make music with tremble and harp. For the Lord takes delight in his people. He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory, shout for joy, and take their rest. Let the praise of God be on their lips and a two-edged sword in their hand to deal out vengeance to the nation and punishment on all peoples, to bind their kings in chains and their nobles in fetters of iron, to carry out the sentence preordained. This honor is for all his faithful. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let Israel rejoice in you, Lord, and acknowledge you as creator and redeemer. We put our trust in your faithfulness and proclaim the wonderful truths of salvation. May your loving kindness embrace us now and forever. Alleluia. The Lord is risen as he promised. Alleluia. In a reading from Acts. God raised Jesus from the dead, and for many days thereafter, Jesus appeared to those who had come up from up with him from Galilee to Jerusalem. These are his witnesses now before the people. We ourselves announce to you the good news that what God promised our fathers, he has fulfilled for us, their children, in raising up Jesus according to what is written in the second psalm. You are my son this day, I have begotten you. This is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad. Alleluia. Jesus called her by name, Mary. She turned to him and said, Rabboni, then he said to her, Do not touch me. I have not yet ascended to the, my father. Alleluia. Mechanical of Zechariah. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of the servant David. 
through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Jesus called her by name, Mary. She turned to him and said, Rabboni. Then he said to her, Do not touch me. I have not yet ascended to my father. Alleluia. Our intercessions. By his own power, Christ raised up the temple of his body when it had been destroyed by death. With joy, let us ask him, Lord, share with us the fruits of your victory. Christ our Savior, when you rose again, you brought to the holy women and to the apostles the joyful news of the world redeemed. Make us witnesses to your risen life. Lord, share with us the fruits of your victory. You promised to all people that we would raise up again to newness of life. Make us heralders of your gospel. Lord, share with us the fruits of your victory. You showed yourself to your apostles and breathed the Holy Spirit on them. Renew in us the presence of the same Creator Spirit. Lord, share with us the fruits of your victory. You promised to be with your disciples to the end of the world. Stay with us today and remain with us always. Lord, share with us the fruits of your victory. Gathering our prayers and praises into one, let us pray the prayer Christ himself taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Father, by this Easter mystery, you touch our lives with the healing power of your love. You have given us the freedom of your sons of God. May we who now celebrate your gift find joy in it forever in heaven. And grant this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. And the Lord be with you. And may Almighty God bless you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let's go in peace now that we might fulfill God's will in our daily life. God bless you all. Have a good day and enjoy the sunshine.